Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to another Sport Games Review and today we're here with Pro Wrestling on the NES. This game was developed by Nintendo and published by Nintendo. It was released in Japan in 1980, October 13th, 1986, North America March 1987 and September 15th, 1987 for Europe. It released to quite favourable reviews saying it's one of the most realistic sports simulators in the day. But does it hold up? Is it good compared to the reviews? Let's find out. I can't actually skip this. <coughs> Alright, there we go. Uh, we have one or two player options. I can't see, I guess because I have no other controller plugged in it won't let me choose. We have Starman, King Khan Khan, Giant Panther, Amazon, King Slender. Uh, the Amazon. Alright, let's go. Oh, kick, and I'm gnawing on his head. Pick him up. Oh, kick. And he's got it for a big slam! He picks him up, and oh, spinning kick, and he's getting him up. And... The other guy is all over him. I can't remember the character's names. Gnawing on his head, that seems to be all he can actually do. Pin! One! Two! And a kick out! And he's kicking my ass completely. Oh, punch you right to the face. Oh, power driver! One! Two! And a kick out by the Amazon! Gnawing on his head again. And a pin. One. Oh, kick. Uh, apparently if you just clear the board again with a down, you just automatically pin. One, two, and a kick out. Tap the buttons, try and get out of this godforsaken pinning situation. BWA, I assume, is the wrestling company that we are currently wrestling for. One, two. I do love the little cameraman down there. And it's a pile driver! There's no way I'm kicking out of another pile driver. Nah, and he wins! Took 1 minute and 34 seconds to lose. Rank 6. Game over. I assume you just go up the ranks then. Uh, let's pick. King Slender to have another match because to be fair I want to give this game a fair shake to oh body drop that was nice oh you can get tossed against the ropes he's all over me there doesn't seem to be a difficulty check that you can stop Oh, got me. Alright. No, I want to keep... I don't want to keep going for the pin because it's never going to stick at this health. Alright. I'm starting to kind of figure out how the game actually works. I can't figure out how to block. Which is kind of a problem in a wrestling game if you can't block. Uh, it'd probably be better if we actually had the instructions, but obviously don't have the instructions. I could probably actually find out. We both know each other out. Oh, to the outside! Oh, Jesus! He dived on me. Oh, it's a twenty count. Oh, it's going with that kind of count—the traditional Japanese count. 
<coughs> One, two. I guess with it being released in Japan first, they're based off Japanese wrestling. One, two. You know what? Oh, pile driver! I don't know why I'm tapping loads so many buttons because most of them don't do anything. Uh, you know what? We're gonna have one more go, and then I'm gonna give an honest and fair review against this game. With the football games, you're guaranteed to have longer. Uh, I'm gonna pick Starman. As you know, I want to fight against somebody different, which I can't seem to do. I'm gonna be this guy, the Starman. And oh, we got me. One. Two. They're me, they got a... No, I want to pick them up. I keep forgetting that you need to click the other button. Oh, how do you recover so quickly? Back body drop. It'd be nice to know how to do some other moves. I'm not going to lie, because obviously I'm just kind of still learning the controls. But this is me, my first honest time, and then you'll have an honest review of what I think about this game. I'm gonna not just, I'm gonna give like other stuff a rating than just, uh, just game. Oh, I think in the middle is health markers. I think. What's that design? Oh damn, I can't figure out how to do any of them moves. And he got me. Okay, I lost in 1 minute 11 seconds. I can't seem to pick up a victory. I'm not that good. And it's the game over. Game over. Okay, let's discuss the game. Uh, actually, you know what? I'm just going to kind of play the game while I'm doing my review here. Uh, okay, first things first. The graphics, as you can see, are very nice for 1986. Um, the gameplay is not bad for a first wrestling attempt, to be honest. Uh, you seem to have a variety of different kind of moves, as you can see. Um, the sound quality in the music's pretty good. Uh, but the actual kind of way to hit the moves and the actual gameplay itself is kind of mediocre. But it's fun. It's a fun kind of very early wrestling game, which I can't give too many bad credits for, because they tried it. It's a really good first attempt, especially from a Nintendo first-party game. So overall, it was pretty good. This is overall a pretty fun little wrestling game. If I learnt the controls properly, I could probably beat a few people. The crowd looks pretty good as well. At least all the crowd's animating and everything. Overall, it's a pretty alright wrestling game. It's going to get a slightly higher than average uh, score of 6 out of 10. Which I think is quite generous, to be honest. So yeah, 6 out of 10 for this uh, pro wrestling game on the NES. I do hope you've enjoyed this little uh, gameplay slash review. If you have, please smash that like button. Please share this all around. Uh, subscribe for more content, and I shall catch you all later. Bye!